What's up? This is Red the Bad Guy again with another video. This video is about losing faith in cryptocurrency. That's right. There's a lot of people who lose faith in cryptocurrency. A lot of buzz on here. You know, the mill doing the live. You know, talking about it and stuff. Seeing the Ponzi scheme, the racket, and crypto is dead and stuff. You know, um, just in the last two weeks, Cryptocurrency got hit real bad. Two things happened. It's a Terra Luna situation and now the Celsius Network situation. Um which brought crypto down. Phew. Right now I think crypto is it lost what two hundred billion dollars or something. I think it's under one trillion. The whole crypto market is under, under a trillion dollars now. You know, a lot of people lost a lot of money. You know, um, but there's always somebody making money. But, um, brothers just losing faith, man. It's just, you know, they just, you know, I kind of figured this was going to happen. You know, I think what's happening is a stress test on the system to see how the system hold up under real volatile conditions. <laughs> you know, and I still say the second run is coming. But I think what's happening is that a lot of people who made that quick money in crypto, they're not gonna be able to make it like that no more. The real quick money is because it was coming up in that first 10 years. Like people just invested in it. You know, you had athletes, you had a, you know, artists, rappers, or whatever, investing in it, and they make it, it was getting a good return, but now, everything kind of, like, stabilized now, so it's not, it's not, you're not going to be able to make that money like that unless you invest in some, you know, um, coins or something, a penny and stuff, or a fraction of a penny, and it was doing that, you know, but, um, crypto is here to stay, you know, and you got to understand, you know, the same people that's telling you in the stock market, crypto with Ponzi scheme, trust me, they playing crypto like a motherfucker. They got it in their portfolio. More and more people is including cryptocurrency as far as, you know, um, the currency. Now, once the regulation comes, you know, that's gonna, that's gonna actually make sure that a lot of people don't come in and scam it and stuff. The situation with the Terra Luna or the, the Celsius Network, the shit like that won't happen and stuff like that. It's still the Wild Wild West. So, just before the regulation come on, I'm really predicting that crypto is gonna take off. Poof. And there's going to be some brothers in this space that's going to have millions of dollars, make millions of dollars. But you got to be patient on this shit, man. Instead of complaining about Bitcoin being down to 22 years, you'd be trying to buy some Bitcoin. Because it was too high, you couldn't get it. Get in now, you can get in. I think it might go down to 19, 18 before it picks back up. I don't know. I think it's picking up today. I don't know. I'm just saying. But the whole system being tested, it was a stress test. All y'all could tell you is that. Don't try to get in crypto to try to make this quick money. Try to do it where you can build up a portfolio, build up a, it's a wealth. Then you can draw on the money, whatever the case you do, what you want to do and stuff, and keep playing it. Like you do with the stock market. That's all I say. But... In my opinion, crypto here to stay. I mean, I was one of those guys who said it was a Ponzi scheme and stuff like that. You know, 
you know, they try to fool black people, get black people in, and then, you know, they crash the market, and they all about to lose their money and wealth, you know, but now it seems like the opposite, they just don't want motherfuckers in, so they know motherfuckers is going to make millions or either billions of dollars if this shit goes back up again, it really goes up, you have this big bull run. So, um, all I can say is this, be patient, hold the line, you know, it is what it is, you know, um, but once it come up, those people that pulled out <laughs> telling you don't, don't do it, don't deal with it no more, you're going to, you're going to have an egg on your face, that's all I can say. And the same motherfuckers, I keep telling you, they tell you to pull out. The only ones that still got it. If it's so bad, why don't they just cash out all their crypto? Say, fuck it. No, they're not going to do that. <laughs> they might talk stupid, but they're not dumb. So hey, tell me what you think, tell me what you think. Till next time, I'll see you later, peace.